So, Mr. Beast made a YouTube video in which he helps people with curable blindness. Everyone and their grandmother decided to virtue signal about it. There's something to, so demonic about this, I can't even articulate what it is. How is this demonic? Why are you making Mr. Beast out to be a horrible person? He cured 1,000 people with blindness. What is wrong with people? You, that should be something that's praised. It's, I, I just, I don't understand. I'm, my mind is blown. Until we have, like, a good uh, healthcare system that this guy approves of. We should just let people who are suffering suffer. That fucking sucks. <laughs> Reminder that Mr. Beast has given away more money than Bosch Hassan and the Serfs to poor people and people in need. So true! So, Mr. Beast made a YouTube video in which he helps people with curable blindness. Everyone and their grandmother decided to virtue signal about it. Uh, you guys want to watch the video? Let's watch it. In this video, we're curing a thousand people's blindness. <laughs> it's gonna be crazy. Most of us see the world like this. But here's the thing, 200 million people see the world like this. But I just made it one less. The surgery is that simple. They can see again. Oh, that's so sweet. How could anybody have a How could anybody have a problem with this? This is so sweet. Yeah. Seriously. You know what? Here's $10,000. Make your day even better. <laughs> is she okay? We're going to go fix more people's eyesight. She's squeezing hard. That is this is so fucking oh, base. No cloudiness, no blurriness. Oh, it's perfect. This is so base. Perfect. Now, what's it like? I can see everything. It's fantastic. Anyone debating against this is his help is in the same boat of those who think student loan forgiveness is awful. It's so strange to me. This is pretty much what I was looking for. I was looking for the takes across Twitter, and uh, we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna see them. You guys ready for this? So I saw this screenshot <laughs> on Twitter. We need an evil Mr. Beast to balance out his good deeds, Mr. Least. He does poverty tourism for clicks. He's already evil. I can't believe the serfs actually put that. I cannot believe the serfs actually wrote a comment that brain dead. So, uh, people honestly praising Mr. Beast yet again. The guy does poverty tourism for cash. If he pays a person's medical bills, lottery style, without informing anyone with his platform that it's fucked he needs to do that, he's just profiting off his ability to do so. What is wrong with people? What is wrong with the serfs? This is somebody who helped a thousand people globally. <laughs> yeah, um, what's better than being, a, like, what's better than being able to profit off of helping somebody in need so you can help more people in need? You, that should be something that's praised. It's like sustainable, you know, uh, charity. Uh, you know, self-sustaining charity. And I think that, I just, I don't understand. I'm, my mind is blown. My mind is absolutely blown by people like the serfs. Is it bad whenever we give charity now? Like, if we have any ability to make money off of it? Until we have, like, a good uh, healthcare system that this guy approves of. We should just let people who are suffering suffer. That fucking sucks. <laughs> I saw people arguing that charity will make younger generations think socialism is necessary. I mean, look, whatever your th views are on socialism, like, whatever, you can make an argument for it still, I'm sure. If you, if you, so w if you want to, you can make an argument for it. Um, but it's ridiculous. That is just a ridiculous take. Okay. Any thoughts on this new supposed moral outrage over Mr. B's curing 1,000 blind people? <laughs> This is so funny. Leftists when rich people redistribute their wealth instead of buying three million homes, three million dollar homes. That's so true. That's so true. Hassan got mad about this. Hassan got mad about about uh, Mr. Beast doing this. Here's Hassan getting mad about it. So Twitch streamer Hassan explain why he's filled with rage from watching Mr. Beast's newest video where he cures 1,000 people's blindness. You watch this video, you go, oh, how how cute and how nice. I watch the video and I'm filled with rage. That, What's like, wrong with you? That we shut off access to a 10 minute procedure because we paywalled it and decided that like some people just simply can't get it. That's not what happened. 
Hassan has no understanding of how healthcare works. I understand what Hassan is saying here, that he wishes he could maybe provide that, but his his reasoning behind it is so wrong. Um, somebody brought it up. We do have a healthcare worker shortage, especially after COVID. It, it, it's ridiculous. It is so insanely frustrating That's that it like, it, it's up to like one YouTube guy to like uh, uh no i don't think we have reached that point like uh, from a medical perspective we have not reached that point decide to make content out of it that like the people who are too poor can't just fucking see that's insane anyway sorry uh, it's just like a deeply deeply frustrating concept you pay for my surgery yeah <laughs> it's not it again that's not how it works. It, it's fine to be mad if you want to provide that for people, but it's not because we paywalled it. I'm not talking about, we're not talking about prescriptions, Kamikaze. We're talking about surgeries. We're talking about procedures. It's not paywalling when it, it, it's just, we don't have enough equipment um, easily and at a low cost available to provide this globally for people at a low cost. I've been talking about globally this entire conversation. I have talked about we do not have the ability. Maybe um, in certain Western countries you can do that, but we do not have the ability to provide these things with little to no cost globally. That is what I've been saying from the beginning. And this person, Mr. Beast, went not just within the U.S., but to other countries and cured a thousand people of their blindness. I think that's pretty fucking based. He cured 1,000 people with blindness. I think that we can acknowledge that that's a good thing. Stars, the big problem is transporting. Most of Africa has no navigable rivers to bring all the stuff they need, food or meds or every anything. Planes, trucks, and rail do not compare to ships. So what I've been saying, go to any third world country, any rural village in any thir third world country, and you will know how hard it is to get access to basic things. If more rich people like Hassan would practice what they preach, the problem might become better. Yeah. The fact that he went to other countries kills the universal healthcare narrative in this context. I don't know anything about that, but if you've been, I, I have been to rural places, rural, rural, um, rural villages in third world countries, and there are still places where it is very hard to get basic things. Uh, Mr. Beast says, uh, it did raise awareness and get tons of people talking. Also, what profits? The average Mr. Beast video lost 1.5 million last year. Jesus. Mr. Beast ratioed the fuck out of the surfs. Holy shit. You're completely correct. That has gotten people talking. I will take the L on that and delete the tweet. But come on, Jimmy. Are you serious? You have multiple channels, a clothing line, an international fast food chain that's in my city. You're not in the business of losing money. Yes, he is. Most of these YouTubers, the biggest YouTubers I've noticed, have, like, multiple things going for them. Um, <laughs> oh, it's fucking crazy. Twist that L harder. People hating on Mr. Beast right now are the same MFs who aggressively defended Hassan Piker, an actual socialist, buying himself a mansion for millions of dollars. That is true. Um, Twitter, when a rich YouTuber actually uses his money for good and it changes people's lives immeasurably. <laughs> angry face, angry face, angry face. There's something de so demonic about this, I can't even articulate what it is. How is this demonic? It's literally what Jesus would do. Holy fuck. I think the greatest representation of the Mr. Beast video about curing cataracts and people's opinions on it is this. Every heartwarming, heartwarming human interest story in America is... Like, he raised $20,000 to keep 200 orphans from being crushed in the orphan crushing machine and then never asked why an orphan crushing machine exists or why you'd need to pay to prevent it from being used. That is not the same. That is not the same at all. This is such a terrible example. Oh my god. It, it's not a good example at all. There is no cataract creating surgery not machine going around giving people cataracts. Just some people are born with them. Some people develop them. This is so such a terrible example. Why is it his responsibility to single-handedly change the healthcare system? I don't know. He's just mad that capitalism is working in this instance. Maybe. I don't hate Mr. Beast. I don't particularly care about Mr. Beast. What I hate is a system where good deeds are only done if they're profitable. Where people are forced to rely on the unreliable benevolence of the rich. 
because they have no other way of having their needs met. I see him as inevitable, emblematic example of the manipulative aspects of capitalism. How is this his fault? Wish people could see through it better, but that's why we need to keep organizing and teaching and learning so people don't hold up a guy who just gets rich off do-gooder stunts. Wow, fuck you. If you do hate him, that's fine with me, lol. I just think one strange aspect of celebrity culture has been that even folks on the left obsess about people more than systems often, to our detriment. The number of people misreading the first tweet, apparently switching the first words around in their head or something, and being like, bro, why do you hate Mr. Beast? is concerning in terms of reading comprehension type stuff. This guy does not know how to make a joke or take a joke. I honestly think this tweet puts to bed the notion that Mr. Beast does good because he's a nice guy, when in reality it's always about growing his brand and being liked. Uh, Twitter, rich people should help others with their money. Me, okay, I'll use my money to help people and I promise to give away all my money before I die, every single penny. Twitter, Mr. Beast bad. <sighs> yeah, I know, seriously, this is so blackpilling for Mr. Beast. Um, this cavernical person is so fucking stupid. I cannot believe how fucking stupid they are. They have a profile picture that indicates that they are a fucking idiot. This person has 90k subs on YouTube? Damn. We have no hope for the human race. Leftists getting mad that Mr. Beast records good deeds and brought attention to the failing healthcare system might be the dumbest people on this website. Reminder that Mr. Beast has given away more money than Vosh Hassan and the serfs to poor people and people in need. So true! The serfs posted this stupid fucking meme. Mother, uh, motherfucker will put his, call himself Mr. Beast when he looks like a fetus with a mustache. Fuck you, serfs. You look like a rehydrated grape. Uh, let's see. When Hassan buys a mansion, a car, and porn stars, he's within the capitalist system. Stop shaming him. When Mr. Beast uses his wealth to immensely benefit thousands of people, how dare he work within the capitalism to help people? I don't understandable I don't understand why curable blindness is a thing. Uh, why don't governments step in and help? Even if you th thinking from uh, even if you're thinking purely from a financial standpoint, it's hard to see how they don't um, ROI on taxes from people being able to work again. This is a pretty cool this is a pretty good thing for Mr. Beast to say, right? In my newest video I blinded 1001 people. Your move, Mr. Beast. Fuck. <laughs> The entire Mr. Beast discourse in one picture. Mr. Beast is using his money to help people. Why are you spreading negativity? Capitalism. Valid criticism about the healthcare system. The healthcare system, you can still have a healthcare system, uh, a universal healthcare system, while maintaining capitalism, guys. Did you know? <gasps> what? You can have capitalism and you can have a healthcare system too? What? Oh my god! <laughs> Whoa, Scoop! Mr. Beast is a prime example of people will find any reason to hate you. The guy literally helped 1,000 people's vision and people are still mad. People upset with Mr. Beast just gatekeeping sight at this point? True! I bet all the people who are criticizing Mr. Beast are people who were born with perfect eyesight sight, and don't have to worry. And they are now mad that more people have the gift of good eyesight. That's what I bet it is. People who are mad at Mr. Beast are probably people who were, who were born with good eyesight and don't have to worry about anything. Mr. Boost, please fix the entire U.S. medical system and dismantle capitalism right now. Thanks. Mr. Boost, please fix the entire U.S. medical system and dismantle capitalism right now. Thanks. Brianna Wu. The irony of Miss Wu Tang scam tweeting and deleting this is palpable. Sorry if this is an unpopular opinion. It's not an unpopular opinion. Apparently, it's the most popular fucking opinion in the world right now, but... But, Mr. Beast sets every warning bell I have off. I don't think there's any truth behind his smile or intentions. I think there's inevitably going to be a scandal when some really dark stuff comes out. That is so fucked up to tweet that. Dude, Sophia Norwich is a friend of mine and very cool. I think these guys are onto something. We should cease all charity and financial assistance until we can destroy capitalism and instate communism. An all-or-nothing approach is the only rational solution. We should shame anyone who gives anything between now and then. Lance Thread from Nicholas D'Oreo. 
Lance started as a comedy gold mine. He shifted the goalpost so far he might actually bump into one of those mass graves he couldn't find during Lauren Southern's debate last year. Jesus Christ. People honestly praising Mr. Beast yet again. The guy does poverty tourism for cash. If he pays a person's medical bills uh, without informing anyone with his platform that it's fucked he needs to do that, he's just profiting off his ability to do so. Um, then Posadas John replied with this. Then the surf says, this is five hours ago after massive public outcry. His video about how he's paying for medical costs should have focused on that. His episode on prison should have been about how solitary confinement is torture, not running out an old one for his friends for the lulls. Uh, the surfs, not everything that you do for entertainment needs to have a message behind it. What the fuck? Wait, are you literally just mad he isn't doing politics? Basing the episode in solitary confinement or running out an old prison to see how long your friends can last in it is p it's political. You <laughs> Nicholas DiOrio with the you need to be placed in solitary confinement. <laughs> that is so fucking based. Oh my fucking god, it's so good. God, dude, fucking love it. I did it. It did raise awareness and get tons of people. You're engaging with a guy who doesn't care about issues beyond what Twitter likes he can get from them, which requires him to ignore any other angle than the most outrageous, disingenuous one. Oh, look, a no-name YouTuber creator is uh, trashing the world's most famous YouTube creator for curing the blind. How can you possibly have an issue with Mr. Beast? Why wouldn't someone profit off their ability to do anything? This man has done so much good. I don't know how it's even possible to hate on him. He cured 1,000 people's blindness and you're hating. You're going to shit on doctors for charging for services and making a profit too. True! Do healthcare care workers not deserve to make a living? Not deserve to live a life? Mr. Beast does what wealthy leftists would do if they were actually morally consistent. So base, Courtney. He didn't cure 2,000 people's blindness, though, so true. He could have done 2,000. Please like the YouTube stream, by the way, guys. If you, like this, if you like the content so far, I think it's been pretty banger. Please consider giving me a super chat. Please consider subscribing on Twitch. Thank you.